How's it going Magpies? Magpie Leon here. In today's video I'm going to be talking about something pretty awesome that players have managed to accomplish in the Halo Infinite flight, in the newest one that is, and that is the melee button combos that players have found out about. Now for me, I'm on the classic controller layout, I'm using controller, uh, so I have to press the right bumper, then X, and then the right bumper again within quick succession. Now this also works with switching weapons, so if I pressed right bumper Y and right bumper, it, it would perform a similar combo, just less quickly. Uh, the reload one is definitely better, but you do have to make sure you fire a few shots in, in, in order to be able to accomplish this. Now I'm going to show you some footage of this in the background of this video while I'm talking. And I'm just going to be talking about what this could mean if it's kept in for infinite sort of, and whether or not I think it will be kept in. Now personally, I can't see this making it past launch, and in fact I don't even know if it'll stay for the rest of the flight. But part of me really hopes it does, because it is something that is really cool and really uh, really nice to be able to accomplish. You feel really satisfied when you're able to do it, especially when you can take out a couple of enemies really quickly, but I can understand why something like that could be quite game-breaking. As you'll probably see in my footage, you can wipe out enemies, like entire squads, within seconds if you are quick enough with it, and that can be quite broken. I will admit it makes stuff like custom games really entertaining, like maybe like a boxing arena type thing where everyone's got like boosted shields and it's like a matter of who can beat the, uh, beat the other up quick enough. Something like that could be really interesting if this is something that's kept in the game. But I can understand for balancing issues, it more than likely won't be. But it's definitely something that's really fun to do. Although I'm basing this off what we've been able to do against bots, and obviously we haven't done the PvP part of the flight yet, so maybe things will be different, maybe it will actually be much harder to accomplish against players, and if more than enough people know about it, then everyone's just going to be doing it to each other. What's the point of using an energy sword or a gravity hammer if I can punch you before you can swing the hammer? Now, if it is kept in, again, it could make for some great custom games, maybe it could be an option that they actually implement for custom games being able to utilise button combos if they want to take it out of the actual PvP. I'd say I, I wouldn't be surprised if it's taken out but part of me wants it to be kept in because it's really funny. Although I imagine as soon as players start using it on me then I'll change my mind. But yeah folks, it's just a quick video today just talking about the button combos and sort of giving my thoughts and obviously I'm going to leave the footage running in the background so you can just have a look at that. But until then, I will catch you in the next one. Ugh! <laughs> 